Digital and influencer marketer Pamela Miyadigoke, also popularly now known as Omoya Ologi, is dishing out some advice on things to consider before marriage. He wrote, and I quote, Lack of money ruins marriages faster than lack of love. With money, you can endure loveless marriages. Without money, it is hard to endure even loving marriages. Love is the greatest gift of all, but money answers all things. Make sure you make money before you marry. Over to you guys. If I make money first, mm -hmm. why, why you say about it was you? No, I you not to get to make your opinion money. first. Don't let me say things I'm not supposed to. So say. wait, what do you believe? You need to make money before you get married. Yeah, hundred percent. How about you? you? Need to make money before you get married. Both part, like not just the. So man. can you enjoy a loveless marriage, but there's money? A what? A loveless marriage, but there's money. No, like I'm not even going to marry somebody that will not love me or have a loveless marriage. So nope, nope, nope. But so, I'm not going to enjoy a poor marriage. Okay, too. okay, okay. Let's put it this <laughs> no, way. No, never. Can you marry a guy that you are deeply in love with, but he's upcoming? He's upcoming. He, he has, has not potential. <laughs> he has yeah. potential. Mm. Well, if he has potential, that means it then won't what, be a broke we, we can, marriage. We can, so you don't want ready. Day. So it's not. It doesn't necessarily have to be a ready-made. If you why are you always having this ready-made yeah. conversation? I've always told you I, I can't be on the table for this whether he was upcoming or ready-made conversation because I am ready-made already. Mm -hmm. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I cannot understand. I cannot flow. So can and you, for okay, me, I mean, okay, your okay, age, do you know okay, my okay, age? Okay, so my forget, age, me. Let's forget. <laughs> oh, okay, let's forget. Let's forget. Maybe I asked this question like nine years ago, then we can no, be talking wait, about for potential. Me, I feel okay, like let's forget about potential. Ready made let's is forget relative. about ready, ready made. Okay. Can you get married? It's relative, actually. Yeah, can you relative. get married to a man mm. who still, how do I put it now? It's who doesn't love you but has a lot of money? No. Why is he coming to marry me if he doesn't love no, me? No, no, no. You need some love like this. Yes. No, 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 no. Some men don't even. Question is just no, I get why. Which one is I, third wife? Don't mind if I let me. Give no, 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 no. For real, because you know some guys. What he's saying now that without money, some guys have money, mm. but they don't want to marry. But because of you know societal pressure and mm. all of that, they just you know I think this girl is always coming around, so I'll just put her in the house. Mm. They don't love the girl, but they just want somebody that mm. will be like a wife figure. Mm -hmm. Should I call it trophy wife? Trophy or what? wife. Yeah, mm. a, a trophy wife that would just be at home. So can you marry that kind of person? Like the person don't love you, but you're just well, there. if we're having that conversation, then I hope you know that there are so many marriages now that are based on um, so many things aside love. Now, mm. it's not about what she looks like. In fact, what she looks like can even be considered. I think pregnancy is one of those things now. Like the moment the girl gets pregnant, you, you get married. Marry. Mm. Yeah, I mean, honestly, that's like a trend. Yeah, but there pregnant, are people who consider married. so many things. Say, what is her career path? What does her family mm -hmm. have to offer? What does she have to offer? If we come together, I how think those are that people that want to get married for real, for marriage purpose. Not. I don't think we understand that. what Pamela is saying. Pamela okay. is saying that money with the lack of money kills a lot of marriages. So yes. if oh, yeah, you it get, does. yes, it does. Mm -hmm. Yes. You think so? Be able to be able yeah. to at least both anymore. sides, both the man and the woman should be able to get themselves to a place where they are at least comfortable. Okay, so my my own my problem is, is why do people than... think? I remember love comfort has to is relative with. too. Being rich is relative, being ready made I... is relative. What is rich to me might but be poor to somebody else. How about our parents? How about our parents? They endured. If I now hold on, they got rich while they were like... married. Do you mm. understand? Why do people feel love has to come with poverty? You no, love doesn't have to come You can have somebody poverty. that is very rich and the person love has to come with you. endurance and respecting each other's, what's it called, growth. That's the way I see it. I you need say to love has to come with commitment and understanding. Not commitment and understanding. But we don't need to make money like a sole reason to get married to somebody because that's misleading a lot he's not saying that's the sole reason but he says you to have to you have to be I mean, comfortable okay if so the fact that okay what about so if what about what about in a case wait what about child, in a case you take care of your child of course what about in a case where you get married to somebody that was rich mm -hmm. right and then in the process of the marriage, he loses his job, loses all um, his company, starts going That's down, different. investments are not working out, and he gets suddenly broke. Will you stop loving that person That's because there's no money anymore? There's no more cash different. flow? God That's forbid, different. but that's How different. How is that different? Because you're already different. into it. The person, you already know the kind of person you married, and then this is not the point you know that, okay, and for that to person be with this to person be able and... to get to breathe himself to that point means he can always pick himself back but, up. It becomes your duty uh, to somebody support saying, other. Nobody's saying, Go and marry a lazy other, man that and is get not yourself working. back up. 
in fact, okay, now, I, I mean, I used to say this, you know, time when people be like, marry a man that is, you know, not there yet, you know, boy has potential. But do you know that it's not everybody that will be rich? But the truth is, I Which won't is get married till I'm rich. It's relative, exactly. What, what, okay, what do you define as being, you just said you won't get married until you're rich, right? What, what is your Till I'm comfortable and I'm able to afford everything I want and need. Everything you want or everything need. you need. Everything I want and need. I and said that's want a problem and need. Because it's, it's okay, now your current girlfriend, you love her, yeah? Mm -hmm. But you want to get comfortable and rich before you mm -hmm. get married to her. That's what Mami Lerner is saying. That. That's what Thank everybody, it's very easy. Very that's what Mami Lerner is talking because it about. comes to a lot of responsibility, especially when you are going to have mm. children. You cannot bring children to this world to stress them, which is one of the things I advocate about. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Stop idea. having too many children and say, oh, Lord, Lord, uh, but, God but will being take your poor child. is no. relative as well. Being what? what? Being poor is relative as well. Yeah, yeah of course, that's what we're saying. Okay, but so all I'm saying is when you hear it. money in love and relationship, don't always think it's a bad thing or that people mm. want to No, no, no. When I saw Pamela's post, I totally agreed, but I just wanted to get your takes on Because even me, I need money to be alive like and this. Look at me like look this. Look at me. Just look at me. It's expensive. It's not easy. So, Moving not having on. money <laughs> and being healthy is a bad thing too. Right? It's just the same thing as being married and not having money. I get what you guys are saying, money. but I just don't think um, we should be misleading a lot of girls out uh -uh. there by letting them... Why are you not misleading guys? Huh? Guys are not misled. It's girls no, are guys, misled. guys, every guy needs to hustle. You need to know uh -huh. that at the end of the day... Rest, no, please. see, and this is a very complicated situation, but at it's the end... It's not complicated of because you, just, you are looking at it, I'm trying to make it complicated. The fact that I need money to live and survive and live a certain kind of life that I'm living, it's the same way that you need money. And I know that I have to work for it. love come in in all of this? Love. Mm. We like to take love to a restaurant to eat. So love is not important. It is right. important. Said, love is important. But it, it cannot solely stand. You know that thing? Love is sweet though. But when you enter, love is sweet. That's just it. It's very easy. <laughs>